A well, sold out crowd crammed into Rupp Arena tonight for Big Blue Madness. The team is ready for action after its win this summer in the 2023 Global Jam. Tonight was the first chance for many fans to see firsthand the power this team hopes to bring to the court. Our Daniel Miskell joins us live from Rupp Arena with reaction from fans who can't wait to get this season underway. Hey, Danielle. Yeah, Big Blue Madness was a wild success here tonight at Rupp Arena. And there was something that I picked up on. You know, Wildcats and their fan base, I mean, it's a huge community, but it still has that small world feeling. And I say that because a lot of these fans that I spoke to earlier actually all told me about how they use some of these Wildcat players on a personal basis. It's the greatest tradition for Kentucky basketball welcoming new family members, and welcoming back old family members. Coach Cal was introduced tonight by UK alum and center for the Milwaukee Bucks, DeMarcus Cousins. Let's watch these guys play and enjoy it, and let's get on with this. Thank you. The Lady Cats tipped off the madness, celebrating the 50th year for the women's basketball program at UK. This shootout challenge was won by guard Maddie Cher. Following the challenge, the Lady Cats scrimmaged. Afterwards, this Lady Cat, forward Asia Petty, took time to say hi to her little buddy. In Asia, right here behind us. Yeah, my brother worked her out. I bumped into more Cats fans who also, by six degrees of separation, knew a player and came to cheer them on. Reed Shepard, because he played against our high school a few times whenever we went to high school, so he's fun to watch. And there's one more high school connection. Emma King, she, I know her from, because she uh, used to play high school ball close to us. We go to Madison Southern, so she went to Lincoln County, so I think we got what it takes to win number nine this year. You know, excited. I'm just ready for the season to get going. So the madness just ended here about an hour ago, but there's more to come next weekend. The Cats will be playing each other in the traditional blue and white game, and that game is actually going to be raising money for Eastern Kentucky flood relief. And then the Cats will be right back here the following weekend at Rupp Arena to face off against Georgetown College. Live at Rupp Arena, I'm Danielle Miskell, Fox 56 News.